And you hear horror stories about the food out there as well. I mean, yeah. We, we like Chinese food here. What we know is Chinese food, but I got it very different out there. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Things that I remember our daughter Catherine came home from school one day and she'd been out with friends immediately afterwards and she at one stage had been forced to eat uh, snake's blood for a starter, you know. And I was saying, this is part of the cultural experience in yeah, China. Yeah, yeah, and yeah. Uh, Miriam will tell you stories of having to sit through meals. And it's very important because the Chinese place a lot of store by what's called guanxi, which is relationship. So Miriam, I think, had to sit through a, a meal of fried slug at one stage and uh, had to actually okay. eat it because they would be insulted if you didn't. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Often, often, you know, when you do an interview with a government official or somebody from an agency in China, yeah. everything ends up with a banquet. So you're about ten officials and you, the correspondent, and your translator. Right. And there's a certain etiquette, you know, uh, plates of food are brought out and you know you're the first person to try the food with your chopsticks and so they're all looking expectantly so, so at there, you there are 10 <laughs> pairs of eyes on miriam and as i try everything and this particular dish as you're came eating out, 10 pairs of eyes <laughs> exactly <laughs> And, uh, and everybody, I wasn't a smoker, everybody around the table with, you know, a cigarette in one hand and a chopstick in another, yeah. and, you know, ashes dropping into the dishes. And, um, <laughs> this, and, and this particular dish uh, and came out and I just said, no, this does not look, this looks dodge, I, I can't, I can't do this. And nothing for it but the eye, ten pairs of eyes looking at me until I actually um, took a bite of what turned out to be some sort of deep fried slug of some description or so my translator told me but that's that's not the worst brendan um a colleague of mine who's up in the north of china up near mongolia told me about um one um at one of these banquets when there was a monkey head put in the middle of a table oh yeah and uh, <laughs> i know where this the is the very going. top of the uh skull was sliced off and everybody was given a spoon and you would eat the monkey brain fresh fresh still oh, twitching fresh monkey, monkey brain. brain i believe it's great it tastes very tastes very good